Hey everyone, welcome back. And today I'll show you how you can stream your favorite movies and shows using an Apple TV VPN. Also, if at any point you'd like to give any of the VPNs that I'm going to mention today a try, you'll find discount links available in the description down below to help you save some extra money, as well as in-depth reviews for each VPN in case you'd like to know more about their services. So let's get started. Now watching your favorite movies and shows on Apple TV is a fantastic way to enjoy your free time. But you should know that your online activity while streaming may not be entirely private. Your streaming history can be tracked and your online activities is always monitored. Thankfully, there is a solution to keep your online activity secure and private, and that's by using a VPN. Now, a VPN or virtual private network is a powerful tool that encrypts your internet connection and redirects your online traffic through a secure server. This makes it challenging for anyone to monitor your online activities, helping you stay safe and secure. Although setting up a VPN on Apple TV may seem complicated, it's a fairly straightforward process. The first step is to select a VPN provider. There are many VPN providers available for you to choose from, but not all of them are reliable or secure. Therefore, I'll guide you in selecting a VPN provider with a solid reputation and great security features. Now, after you choose a VPN provider, go ahead and choose a plan which you want to subscribe to. These providers usually offer a handful of options to choose from, so choose one that's suitable for your needs and situation. Since Apple TV doesn't have a built-in VPN client, you'll need to set up a VPN on your router. This will enable all of your devices on your home network, including Apple TV, to connect to the VPN. Now, after setting up the VPN on your router, it's time to connect your Apple TV to the VPN. To do this, all you have to do is head over to the settings, select network, and then go to the network section where you can choose your VPN network. Finally, enter your login credentials, and you're done. Now, as I promised at the beginning of this video, I'll run you through my current top VPN choices so you can pick one that best suits your needs. And so I've been regularly testing the best and most popular VPNs and have narrowed it down to Express, Nord, and Surfshark as the best three VPNs overall. Of course, they all vary in budgets and features, yet they all have a kill switch. They're excellent for torrenting and they all consistently work of streaming services such as Netflix, Hulu, and Amazon Prime Video, and that's why these are my favorite three, but depending on your situation and preferences, one of them may be a better choice for you, and I'll explain why. Now, starting with ExpressVPN, and this is going to be the one to get if you're looking for the best overall, fastest, and easiest to use VPN, and it has the most verified no locks policy, which was demonstrated through a real-life stress test proving that they don't collect or track any user data. It has over 3,000 servers in 94 countries, which is a big number of countries allowing you to easily access content from all over the globe. Plus, you can secure up to five simultaneous connections per account, and it's compatible with most devices. And so ultimately, whenever people ask us what the best, most reliable VPN is and don't mind spending a few extra dollars to ensure the highest level of reliability, Express is our trusty go-to choice for those looking for a premium VPN. Next up is NordVPN, and Nord is what I consider the best value VPN. It has over 5,400 servers in 60 countries, and while more servers does not necessarily mean better service, this can help with speed and latency, especially if you use a VPN for gaming, or if you want extra features such as a threat protection which blocks ads, malware within websites, as well as protect your device from harmful files, which is a neat little feature. And so Nord kind of gives you more options to fiddle with, and that's where the value for the money comes from, especially that it's about as fast as ExpressVPN in terms of performance, and will let you secure up to six devices per subscription, as opposed to ExpressVPN's five device limit. So all in all, if you're someone looking to have a few more options in your VPN, then Nord would be the one to get. And then finally, Surfshark is our pick for the best budget VPN. 
And while it has all the essentials like Express and Nord, it's not quite as fast as those two. Although with Surfshark, you're allowed to virtually secure an unlimited number of devices with just one account, so it's a great option if you don't want any simultaneous connection limits. You also get over 3,200 servers in 100 countries, which is a lot. You still get some bonus features such as an ad blocker for blocking pop-ups, two types of specialty servers, as well as no borders mode and rotating IP, which can be very useful if you're looking to use your VPN in a restrictive country. So ultimately, if you're looking to spend the least amount of money but still have all the core features of a premium VPN, or if you need a VPN that allows you to secure all of your devices, or if you have a large family, then Surfshark is the ideal choice. And so to sum it up, these are definitely the best in the business. Express is a premium VPN with a strong emphasis on security and utmost anonymity, and it's perfect for those who are privacy conscious and are looking for the best VPN overall. Then NordVPN is a well-rounded, high-performance VPN that offers a lot of value for the money and is ideal for those looking for bonus features that can be useful in a variety of ways besides base VPN functions such as a strong encryption, secure torrenting, and working with streaming services. And Surfshark is truly the best budget VPN that gets the job done without sacrificing any of the necessary security features that you usually get with more expensive VPNs. And as an added bonus, you get to share it around with as many of your friends and family as you like, which is a great plus. And there you have it. Streaming on Apple TV has never been easier thanks to the help of VPNs. So that's it for this video. Again, if you're interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing and discounts as well as in-depth reviews in the description down below. And feel free to comment below if you have any questions as I love getting to interact with you guys. And like and subscribe if you found this video helpful or would like to stay up to date with future videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.